Well, howdy, hello, and welcome back to my channel. It's Kim Odekoven, KRO Designs, here to do a little plan with me. I am using my sticker kit from Paper and Glam. Isn't this cute? It's like her bookshelf in her office. I love the fact that she like incorporates her life into the stickers and stuff. It's super cute. Um, and if you haven't seen this, this is the seasonal living list. Um, she has suggestions on fun things to do because I need the help in trying to remember some of the fun things that um, I should be doing instead of all of the tasks. Yeah, I need a little reminder sometimes. So I'm going to be using this kit. This is entire August plus a couple extras. This is Glam Reads and You Better Work, which might be incorporated somewhere in here. Um, I've started decorating my monthly spread. I've got a couple stickers. I just like to use these basic stickers like these for timed events and they are color coded. So I'm kind of anal like that. Um, so what we're gonna do is get started. I did pull some washi. Um, I got, I don't even know what this is from, but I thought the colors were cute and they're a little, little jazzy with the, the teal involved because I love to incorporate the extra teal, which is with the binder. So it kind of like pulls it all together. Gotcha, gotcha, little arty farty stuff. And then I got some Simply Gilded. I've got this really tiny, um, small, was it five millimeter? I don't know. Um, washi tape. Yeah, I don't, I don't have a clue. And then I've got my Harry Potter washi tape. If I can ever find the end to show you. I thought this would be cute because it's all yellow. Isn't that, it's like sparkly. So this is from the Harry Potter Simply Gilded collection. So I might be pulling that in. I don't know. Let's just see how the wind blows, but I am going to be using exactly what you see here. So let's get going. I always like to start off with my basics and write down exactly my timed events. So if I, if you don't know what I'm doing, I'm just looking up here at my monthly. This is like my inbox. All of my timed events go in here before I get the weekly spreads done. So um, I have these three things pretty much only for the entire week for timed events, which is the bomb diggity because I feel like lately I've been doing a lot, a lot of um, doctor's appointments and dentist appointments. So let's do uh, football in black. Why not? So um, Jack tells me. So 8 to 12 football. So he lets me know. Hey mom, um, I want to be there at 6.30. And I'm like, what's to say what? Um, this is like, they give out the, the pads and stuff tomorrow. So he wants to be one of the first ones in line. So he gets the, the good pads, or the good pads, so who knows. So I have a major early, early, early morning tomorrow, but I do get my hair done, very excited. Um, and I've got, well, I shouldn't say tomorrow because today is August 2nd, Friday, and tomorrow would be Saturday. But I usually do these playing with me's on Sunday, which is why I'm totally confused. All right, and that's probably why you are totally checking out right now haha -ha. so I wrote those down let's go stick them on I do want to make that football all the way across so which one to pick well I'm not picking the hearts because that doesn't really feel football-y to me this one is a little bit too black uh, let's use this one it's got some black and some teal it'll pull in a lot of color because it'll go all the way across so let's go ahead and stick that first down can't decide if I should go all the way across the seam I think I'm gonna. Let's do it today. So let's get these lined up. Whoa! Whoa there, ponies. Let's get these puppies lined up here. And then we're gonna go all the way across. Dun, da, da, da. Let's make sure we get some black in here because that's the whole point. And some pink. And there you go. Da. That's not bad, not bad at all. Look at me, professional. All right, now I need my handy dandy plan with Cleveland. This is like a credit card they gave me, or gave everybody. It was from the swag bag, so get rid of that. Hope I didn't overlap in the middle. That's like the tragic part. There's a little off over there, but I'm gonna call it good. Let's get my X-Acto knife out. And if you haven't noticed, I'm wearing my usual on the back of my chair sweatshirt that I always have because it's summertime I leave it there and I don't like my hands and my wrists when I 
on camera. I know, weird, weird problems, but we all have our things and that's apparently one of mine. All right, I wonder if that's gonna bug me. I'm gonna try to peel this up. It's like the tiniest little bit of a millimeter, but I notice it. Do you know what I mean? I really shouldn't be bothered. Okay, well, that's better. Good Lord. I need to stop stressing about these things, but you know what? It makes me happy to have it straight. Let's do this one too. Hallelujah. All right. Oh, that looks pretty good. That looks really good. All right. Let's get these timed events in here. And I do treat this kind of like an hourly. So I would, if I was the one playing football, I would like totally block off the section. But we all know it's not me who's playing football. So I do have a hair appointment at 1.45 on Monday. So that's in the PM. Let's put it kind of down here because I'm going to make lunch. And then we'll just line this puppy up since it's just about the same time. Happy day for me, guys. I get an ultrasound on Tuesday. Super fun. No worries. I don't think there's anything too terribly wrong with me. But she's just going to double check. Make sure all the, the girl parts are working just the way they should. All right. Slightly off kilter. But I will survive. All right. So we got once we got those down there. Can you believe there's like nothing else? It's crazy. Now I get to like fill in the week. All right. I did forget. I will have to say I forgot about my Bible study. I kind of feel bad about that every Monday. Us girls get together at four o'clock Eastern every day, every Monday, once a week. So we've got that. I'm gonna put that here. Let's do it before the break. Cause I like totally designate that break as my, you know, dinner break, dinner prep, whatever. Okie dokie. Um, now, Monday, I garbage and recycle do come. So we're gonna put that there. And I'm gonna try something different this week. I'm gonna try to do a little bit more freestyle. Uh, not wrapping, but I'm just gonna like, Put things where I want them, at least in accordance. Um, usually I don't do icon stickers yet, but let's put that book Bible study thing right here. I'm going to stick it in the space. Because why not? You got space there. All right. Uh, on this section down here, I am going to make that a calls and email list. And I know that we have... I always think that's a phone. It's not. It's a remote. But we're going to make calls. Here's a cell phone. And we'll find a word right there. I'll grab these two. And then as a base, I'm going to grab, I do a header or let's do a header. I'm going to tie in some black. Wait, this one is I'll tie in some dark pink. So that one's light pink and light pink. I need dark pink. That is the logic behind there. We're going to make this entire bottom section calls. And I'm going to put this here to offset the, um, the books. And then we're going to have email. Call and email. Oop, the L is going to get in the way. Move you down. Downtown. All right, and I need one last checkbox. We're going to use this floral one right here. And that is what that is. Oh, it's too long, so I'm going to zip, zip. And I always like to leave this space for my meal planning, so I'm not going to mess with that space ever. It's like I love... I love to meal plan. I've been doing it forever and I cannot survive without it. But that looks okay. I think we've got mostly Monday done. I don't have anything to write here just yet. Oh, um, Tuesday before OBGYN, Jack's going to be at football. So I think what I'm going to do is we are going to go school shopping. Um, I think that is the plan. Let's see if there's a school full box back here. I could use this. It's a lot of orange. How about we do this? How about I cut it in half? 
and we can save it for next time. So it's not like a full box. We'll just kind of do a quarter box. That'll work. We'll put that back there. So let's do that. And then underneath, what I've been doing, I love these stencils. Oops. I've been loving these stencils from Erin Condren. So I'm going to do some check boxes. My hot mess. So let's just do where we're going to go. Well, I know I have an Old Navy pickup. I ordered some uniform pants. They were six bucks a piece yesterday. So, so we're going to go to Old Navy. Um, we're going to go to Walmart for sure. And then we need haircuts. The boys are starting to get really shaggy. Perfect. So I know I need my email list down here. This one I always seem to leave as a cleaning list because Tuesday's a good day to clean in the afternoon. I don't know what it is, but after Monday and how busy it is, we'll do a cleaning day on. Let's pick pink this time and then let's get some cleaning icon stickers and let's incorporate some black with that. See how it makes a triangle? Like that is totally eye pleasing. And if I add this one up here, then it's kind of like blends those two together. See, tricky, tricky. I'll just put a checklist down here too, a handwritten one. So right off the bat, I know I need to mop the kitchen. That did not get done last week. Mop kitchen. I need to. We need to clean um, downstairs bath. Hmm. Oh, vacuum. Oh my. We're gonna vacuum up in main and downstairs. Okay, we're just going to leave that for B because I know that we're, I'm going to have more things. But, oh, you know what? We're going to have to mow this weekend. i got to write that down. Sorry, hold on a second. Let me get my brain dump out. See, this is what happens when you start planning. You get, you get your mind all going. We are up to Wednesday. Uh, free day for me, pretty much. I'm going to concentrate on all day food prep for um, the football camp. So I'll be cooking on Sunday next week after this, the whatever day that is, the 18th. I am going to be cooking an entire meal for the football team. Yeah, the whole thing. Like for 120 kids, Sloppy Joes, and I'm gonna do apple crisp and watermelon. And I'll show you, I already got started. So here's the shopping list for it. So Slappy Joe's potato casserole, you know, the hash brown one, and then apple crisp. So here's the menu. And this is the shopping list. I never thought in my entire life I would need three gallons of ice cream, but honestly, the boys adore it. They love the food and I am happy to help. So we are going to be cooking all dang morning. So I need to, on Tuesday, take out meat because I have to have the, I don't have to have the meat defrosted, but it sure beats running the microwave for like an hour and a half. So we'll just do it here after I get home. Take out meat. So on Thursday, I know for sure that Jack's half pay or full page ad is due for um, for the fall press guides. So I'm going to be just sticking that here and then we'll do, all right, work on full page ad because it's due on Friday. I want to make sure I have that and then I'll have to write a check and mail it in. 
Yeah, old school. I guess I could have Jack drop it off at school, but I'd rather spend the 50 cents on stamps. So while we're out and about, though, I am going to put my next box down here because I need stamps. I ran out when I wrote all those letters to my husband not too long ago. TJIF sticker, and I think this week we could use it. Oh, I already used it. All right, we'll just use this weekend banner. Let's use this one. Oh, maybe it's the shopping one. Let's use the shopping one because we went shopping this week. So let's make it interesting. I'm going to go ahead and slice the week in the end, kind of around the corners to make it look like it kind of was meant to do that. And let's put it right there. But I'm really not liking how bare this looks up here. So let's do this. Let's stick some washi tape. I know this looks really top heavy for now, but just bear with me here. Let's get these together again. Get them together. I can't straight shoot at all. Now I'll slit that apart. Ta-da! little bump over there but I think I'm gonna cover it up with this weekend let's do that week let's do it there I gotta cut that off that's gonna drive me bonkers yay all right weekend vibes right there Alrighty, full disclosure, it is officially Saturday morning. My husband walked into my room at 4.35 that I, while I was filming and he said, we got to go in 10 minutes. So uh, that's what I did. Left everything as is because I really wanted to finish this real time with you. Um, and this is what happens with planning. I got an email last night while I was at the uh, Indians game and it said that we have an open house Kind of like meet the the new kids on the block kind of thing over at a school. Um, so it's called Friendship Day. Um, so we're just going to make that on one of these and stick it on Saturday and call it good. And that would be right here. Friends National Friendship Day or something. I don't know. We got to go to school. Let's talk about, I would talked about Thursday, Friday. Um, we are going to go on a date night. So I'm going to, and plus, you know, see how this is so top heavy and there's nothing really on the bottom. Minus, of course, the meal plan, which I'll get to um, in a next video. I'm planning to do a meal plan video that I hope you guys will enjoy. Um, I've been meal planning for like 900 years. It seems like and that is what that video is going to be about. Um, what is with the non-straight stickers? Okay, we can do this. And then in this box over here in the corner, something I really want to try to do every single week. Um, I usually have a sticky note on the next page. I'm going to flip this page over and see if it's there. No, I don't have one. I usually have a long sticky note for tasks that need to be done. I really wanted to say this week one of these black headers because see how much black there is up on top and none really a lot in this corner. So I'm going to bring in this little black divider. We'll stick this. It's a header and it's gold foiled. Isn't that gorgeous? See not so pretty right there. And since there's no next week sticker I'm just going to go ahead and put that there but leave enough pink below that it kind of add something. I'm going to add something. This looks so weird with that. We're going to put some signature glam on there. I'm going to put this coffee in a butt first. And it isn't Lisa Marie sweet. She, uh, she writes on your first order and almost every order you get. So she's so sweet that way. So to do, but first next week. And like I said, I really want to make the base here a little bit more pronounced. So I'm going to go ahead and add this Harry Potter washi tape from that Simply Gilded collection. It'll incorporate some of that um, darkness and the yellow associated with the August. And I tried to make it so it would end right abruptly like there. And then I wanted to, you know, continue on over on that section. Then we're going to add a sticker on top there and I'm going to go ahead and add this 
one little header up here. I want to tie in some more of the teal aspect from the top and the bottom. And as you can see, I've got one, two, and to triangulate to make everything better, I'm going to add just one sticker over here and it should make a big difference in the way the balance is for at least color. On the top over here, we always do errands on Sunday, Mark and I. So we're gonna go ahead and add one of these black ones. Again, I'm turning it around because if I put this right under here, do you see how it makes that block shape? I'm not sure I care for that. So if I just put it right underneath that washi tape and then add here, the errand sticker, do you see how it kind of blends a little bit together? And then we'll just write what errands we're gonna run for sure. We always go to Aldi on Sunday mornings. Saturday, I always tend to do a whole bunch of laundry. Instead of writing laundry or doing a laundry checklist, I'm gonna add this closet. I love how it hangs from the central hanger. This is from the Organize um, collection. Let's get it straight first of all though. There we go. And that looks good. It's kind of filling out a little bit of space, but it, yeah, it leaves me other space to add my checklist which I will go ahead and use the stencil right now to do. I'm not gonna add very many, but at least I've got, I'm gonna do five. Um, rule of thumb, odds always work. Odds and triangulation is what I use. So I could have put four there, but five looks a little bit better. So I've got check boxes over here, check boxes over here, and you see how it again triangulates over there. Now, as you can see that this little section abruptly ends over here and you see how this abruptly ends, but we have a little trailer. So this is the perfect spot for something that's not quite so large, but would add a little bit of, um, you know, angle dimension over here. And I love the black because again, we're trying to incorporate black throughout. And I was going to use this sticker for, um, for like movie night but there's no black in it except for the writing. So I'm just gonna quickly cut off the now showing part. And so I've got this sticker and I can just easily add it to this side over here and then um, write what movie we're gonna watch over here and just see how it kind of like trails down and it's starting to really take on some a static dimension. Anyway, I'm going to add this polka dotted white and black washi. I think it's going to work well connecting the two pages kind of as up above, but not all the way. I just want to kind of put it there, get a little cutty McCut cut, Check it out, see if I want it to go all the way across and I was right, I don't. I don't think it would look good. We'll just get it to there. So if I went all the way across, it would kind of like do too much of the matchy matchy. And then we'll just trim it off. And this gives me plenty of space in the middle to put more check boxes, even put a full box or two if I wanted to and complete my week. All right, guys, if you enjoyed, I'm sorry this was a little teachery. I get kind of sometimes like that because of just the way that I'm wired because I am a teacher by nature. I'm an art teacher by trade, but I now am a substitute teacher. So if you're ever wondering why I talk in teacher voice, <laughs> that is why. So don't forget to get a like and subscribe if you guys enjoyed this. Again, I'll fill out this section in uh, just a few moments. I'll start filming that about my meal planning and how I get her done. All right, guys, thanks so very much for stopping by. See you next time. Mm -hmm.